Smart. So, I'm Teacher Precious. At kamusta naman ang mga ka-Art Smart natin ngayong araw? So, ngayon, magpiprint making tayo. Meron tayong, ah, para lang ano ah, <laughs> kung, kayo na, kung meron kayong mga gulay, tagayin ko, yung buntot ng pechay, tsaka okra, o kaya halamansi. Kung wala namang prepared na gulay, pwede mga cotton buds, o kahit anong uh, object na may texture na pwede natin gamitin pang print. Pag wala, fingers na lang. <laughs> Okay? Sige yeah. Okay, so excited na ba kayo sa ating activity ngayon? Excited na ba? <laughs> okay, so ang gagawin natin ngayon ay footprints and patterns. So, okay. So, dito may sample ako dito. So, di ba yung mga flowers na yan? Alam niyo ba kung saan gawa itong stamp na to? Okay, gawa yan sa... Alam niyo ba kung ano to? Anong part ito? Yan. Ito yung likod ng pechay. Di ba kapag nagluluto tayo, pinuputol natin to. Tapos ito yung tira. Di ba? Yan. So kung wala naman kayong ganitong pechay, pwede nyo gawin tissue lang. Tissue na. Di ba tissue? Yan. Kasi baka yung iba hindi prepa walang prepared na gulay. So tissue, paper towel, tupi nyo lang. Tapos i-roll yun na lang ng ganun. O kaya papel. Papel na matigas yan. So yan, para lang makakabuo kayo ng parang... Rose, di ba? Parang flower. Okay, or kung meron ng pechay, yan. Di ba? Pechay. Okay? Tapos, gagamit din ako yung mga dots dot na nakikita nyo rito. Nagaya nyo itong prints. Alam nyo kung saan to gawa. Hmm? <laughs> gawa sa yung dulo ng okra. Okay? Okra. Yan. Gaya nyo ito. Yan. So, yung mga ganito, you can make it as a bookmark, mga decorate ng mga paper bag. You can make uh, sa for greeting cards, background for greeting cards, or background sa inyong mga artworks. So, it's up to you. Okay? And we will also be using some paint. So, kung meron kayong mga paint. Ayan, paint. And... So, you can use a paintbrush or yung something na pwede nyong pag, pagbabara ng paint. Pwede rin kayo gumamit ng mga Tupperware, kagaya nito. Lagyan nyo ng paint para pwede kayo mag-stamp-stamp. Okay? Ayan. Pwede rin kalamansi. <laughs> If not, you can use tissue ha, na nirolyo. Ganyan. Or any object. You can use pwedeng Lego, pwedeng laruan. You can be creative. So, ngayon, try muna natin gawin itong ating flower. Okay? So, kung meron kayong pechay, yung pwede to. If not, mag-roll yung tayo ng tissue, dodabihin yung tissue. Ha? Ayan. Tissue. Pwede yung paper. Pwede, you can also use paper. Dapat tissue na matigas ha. Paper towel. O kaya paper na lang. Ordinary yung paper. Ordinary yung paper. Gagawin natin yung parang rose. Okay? If, if wala kayo yung materials. If not, pwede rin cotton buds. Kumpul-kumpul. Ayan. Diba? Okay, so now I have this paper. So, ang gagawin lang natin. So, meron ako dito. I have here yung pechay. So, let's try to put paint. Try muna natin, ha? Okay, pwede rin natin itry sa tissue kung wala kayo. Or paper. Paper na ni-roll. You can do stamp. Ayan, stamp natin. Pag mahirap i-stamp, you can also paint, uh, paint it. Parang ganito. Actually, better if sticky yung paint nyo or using use finger paints. Hindi watercolor. But watercolor is also okay. <laughs> ayan. Okay, now. Ayan, meron na tayo parang pechay. Try natin to print it. Let's see. And then you have to, sometimes hindi pantay ah, sometimes, minsan hindi pantay, so kailangan iikot-ikot nyo, ganun-ganun nyo, yun. Yun, di diba? parang rose. Sige, try naman natin using tissue or paper na ni-roll, gaya nito. Let's see if it will also work. Kailangan lang madami kayong paint. At marami kayong paint. Ayan. Oh paper na ni-roll. Kasi absorb niya eh. So, dapat madami. 
Let's see ha. Ayan. Tissue naman to, tissue. Let's see if ganun din. <laughs> Na-absorb niya. Kailangan marami, kailangan marami. Need to add more. Add more paint. Add more paint. Oh. Yun! Diba? Just, you can rotate it. Pwede nyo iikot. Ayan, diba? To make it bigger. Ayan. We just want to make a rose. Parang flower. Okay, you can practice first on a scratch paper. Practice muna kayo. Diba? Tissue lang to, ah. Tissue. Okay? If not, you can use fingers. Your fingers or cotton bud. It's din na pinag-ikot-ikot. Tingnan nyo ako. I'm making a rose eh. Yan. Kita nyo itong cotton buds. And you can also, yan, pwede nyo i-tape to. Then put them, wet it, basain. Tapos, tingnan nyo. Get paint. And pwede rin. Maraming ways, there are many ways how you can make prints. <laughs> if you don't have uh, ano ah pag wala kayo nung only if wala kayo uh, paper ay sorry yeah. i-add natin I'll add more flowers I'll add more yan and then yung siyang lagay dito you can put them here and then put paint here yan you can dip it, get more paint, or you can put paint here. Sometimes kulang, ha? minsan kulang. So you have to put it again. Ah, yung ating rose. Yeah, meron lang akong itong ganito. Ayan, ito yung flowers na. <laughs> and tapos, when you're done with that, you can add the stem. Add the stem. Oh, stem. Green stem. Oh. <laughs> ah, you can make the leaves. Ah, you can draw the leaves. Okay. Yeah. Ah, I we forgot the leaves. Oops. Ayan. Okay. Ayan. Ito tayo ng mga leaves. You can add some grass. Ayan. Here. Okay. Ayan. Parang ganito. Look at mine. Ito yung unang gawa ko kanina. Ayan. Kamusta naman yung mga work nyo? Ayan. Nagawa ko na. Okay. Okay. What else? Let's see. Finished? You can also add the sun. Pwede nyo rin lagyan ng araw. Pwede kayo mag-practice muna. You can practice first. And then you can make another one. And araw. Pwede rin my rainbow. You can use oil pastels too. Oil pastels for the rainbow. Okay, hindi naman kailangan. Paint lang lahat. Okay. Red. Orange. Yellow. Green. Blue. Purple. If wala kayong ano, you can just paint it. <laughs> ah, diba? Flowers. Oh, yeah. Okay. You can also make some clouds. <laughs> yeah, like that. Okay, or like this. Diba? Mas maganda yung shape nitong opera. Kasi, ay, pecha. Itong, the first one, kabingi. <laughs> this one is better. Okay? So hard when you're using tissue. You need to put more paint kasi the tissue or the paper will absorb the paint. So, dapat damihan nyo pa yung paint. So, next, we'll try to make okay, try ko naman makita ko rin yung isa pa you can also use ano eh pwede rin bouquet ng flowers nuwari ito uh, 
Bukiin naman. Buki. Buki siya. One, two. Yan. Yan. Okay. Siyang na. Yan. <laughs> Tapos lagyan niya na lang ng green. Na lalagyan. Yan. Okay. Diba? Okay. There. Sige, next, we'll try to make patterns. Kagaya nito. Look. See? Patterns. You can use this for your gre making greeting cards, decorating a paper bag, or bookmarks. Wala lang akong ribbon eh. But you can make bookmarks. Kagaya nito. Diba? Pang ipit sa book. Look oh. See? Pinuno ko lang siya. Patterns. And these are patterns. What does pattern mean? Diba? Pattern means repeating. Repeating. Uh, repetition. Repeating an element. In this case, we're repeating the prints. Okay? So, let's try to make a print again, like this. Using okra or calamansi or cotton buds or your fingers. Spreading fingers. You can use Lego. You can use uh, pe pencil eraser, okay? Pwedeng iba-iba kung wala kayong gamit na nahanap natin, okay? You can use crumpled tissue. Okay? Okay, sige, next, let's try to make yung patterns naman sa okra. This time, I'll be using yung dulo ng okra. Okay, so the technique here, so the okra is very slimy, madulas, di ba? So what I did, pupunasan nyo muna siya at tatanggalin muna natin yung uh, ibang slimy, slime. Okay, you can remove the slime first. Para mabawasan lang. So you can see the pattern. Kasi minsan pag malagkit na malagkit siya, uh, hmm, parang siyang glue. It's like glue. Okay, so let's try to make some pattern. So I'll try to make... Purple. What color are you using? Anong color naman yung gamit niyo? Ako, I'll try orange. Check nyo ah, if it's too slimy, pag masyadong madulas, wipe it with tissue. Punasan nyo muna. Okay. Yan, pag ganito siya, look, masyado siya, there's too much paint. It's too slimy. Too slimy, so you have to remove. Yan. Huwag masyado. Yan, dapat kita lang yung butas. Okay, so let's try to make some patterns. <laughs> let's try to make it even. Yun. See? Yun. Then, pag wala ng paint, just get more. See? Yun. See? Sometimes, ah, if it's too much, if you put too much, you can't see the pattern. So, you have to be careful. You have to wipe it, not too much. Huwag masyado. Okay, you can use this when you to make a greeting card or bookmarks or paper bags. Yeah, stamp. This is a pattern. So, it's a repeating. Ayan na, mas better na yung shape nyo. Natuyo na. So, kasi nawala na yung slimy. You have to use it. Yeah. You can also use potatoes. Diba? Pwede rin patatas. Pag wala kayong ano, ibang pantata, if you don't have other materials, yan, tape it. Hindi. At pantay-pantay. Yan. Diba? Now, you can use this also. Yan, may pattern na siya. You can use this to make prints. Tinan nyo. Hindi hmm. <laughs> lang kita yung isa. Yan. You can use calamansi. Who's using calamansi? Yung iba yata. Do you have calamansi? Yan. Yan. Yan, patterns, di ba? Mm, what else? Yan. Okay. Okay, let's add more. Maybe we can add more, di ba? Maybe cotton buds. Well, I don't have calamansi. Hmm. 
Maybe I'll just, if not, you can also use your fingers. Ano pa ba? Let me see. Ano pa bang material? Oh, we can use the back of your pencil. Pencil eraser. You can also do this. Maybe pwede rin to, di ba? If, if, if wala kayong material, see? Hmm. <laughs> Yan. You can be creative. Hindi lang gulay. If not, you can use the stump of the okra, yung likod. You know, ito. The back of the okra, different side. See? The same as a pencil eraser. Diba? What else? Maybe I'll use blue this time. Blue. Uh, blue, kasi blue and orange are complementary color. Blue. If it's slimy, pag masyadong madulas, just wipe it. Ayang naman yung paint sa loob. Ayan, let's see. Isang kaya lalagay? Maybe here. Oh, you know. Nice. Ayan. If it's too wet, look. Oh, it's too wet. This is too wet. So, wipe nyo muna sa tissue. Move it. Or put it on a scratch paper first. Ayan, kasi it will look like this. Oh. Matatabunan siya. Ayan. You can experiment. And then don't worry if you make a mistake. Okay. This is actually another practice. And you can use your fingers too. Yan lo, at may pattern. Diba? Diba na? Yan. So, tapos na rin ba kayo? Are you finished? And syempre, don't forget, kids. Okay, reminder lang na after uh, uh, na kumain ng masustansyang gulay, always eat it. healthy foods, diba? Because we need to be strong and healthy, especially now, diba? Okay? At syempre, after our work, don't forget to clean up. Okay, you need to clean up. Kailangan nyo pong maglinis and don't forget to wash your hands. Diba? Always wash your hands. Okay, alright? So, thank you so much for joining us today. So, tulad ng nakita nyo, lahat tayo may kakayahang gumawa ng artwork. So, hindi lang drawing, you can also use prints. Diba? And then, uh, okay, you can try different techniques. So, yung mga suggestions nyo, like ibang prints, ibang objects, you can try. Okay? And then, show us. Okay? Then, with constant practice, mag-develop din ang ating skills. Okay? Thank you so much! Know your art, be art smart!